The video clip is just a few seconds, but it clearly shows a vehicle driving on the field at Ralph Carter Park last Monday hitting someone, a 17-year-old who tumbled over the hood of the blue BMW and fell to the ground. A witness who got out of the way told investigators it accelerated, driving directly at the victim. The driver was intentionally driving towards him. Incredibly, the victim wasn't seriously hurt and was able to walk away, but the images helped detectives identify the driver, 18-year-old David Reese, who was arrested at his home facing two felony charges. Investigators say a disagreement between two groups, fueled by social media, brought several dozen teenagers to the park to fight it out. In addition to a vehicle being used as a weapon, deputies say a 17-year-old girl had a taser, which she used to attack another teen. The victim was repeatedly tased um, as a result of that, which was described as going on for about four minutes. Um, the victim suffered some burns to the skin. Detectives say that victim was hospitalized with potential permanent disfigurement from the taser. The 17-year-old girl facing felony charges, too. The chaos here played out in broad daylight in a residential area next to an elementary school. We just don't want any escalation. We want our kids to be safe in their parks. We want our, our, our community to be safe. We just don't want any more of it. Nor say investigators will they stand for any retaliation as a result of this trouble. Flagler County deputies have beefed up patrols at all local parks as a precaution. Claire Metz, WESH 2 News. Anyone with any additional information about the fight last week is urged to contact law enforcement immediately.